Welcome back to another episode of What the Frick Is He Doing Now? I hope you all doing well just like me. Today's a shitty day outside, but you know what? Life is still good. Let's get going. The Amazon guy just left, so I got I finally got my last piece that I needed, which were these two connectors. Um this is what I needed so I could try out the entire I need I'm gonna run the pump to make sure that it's not leaking, but I wanna run it for um, a couple of days to make sure uh, everything is good. Twice I assume everything is right. So I had to cut this one down because it's super long. I didn't realize they were this long when I bought them. I like the fact that they were gray, so that had a huge part in why I bought these right here. They're gonna be hanging out of this part here. So they're gonna be coming out of here. So I kind of was really I was happy that they were gray. That was the whole purpose of it. So, so we should probably start on uh, prepping this. This one is the one that I cut. It's actually gonna go closer up against the wall over there because the trim gets in the way when I'm spinning it in. Next one. I wanna make sure that uh, it doesn't leak. It's very important <laughs> that it doesn't leak. And this way I can fix everything. If it leaks, fix it all now. And uh, if it doesn't leak, I'm gonna be surprised. Nothing works that smoothly with me. So if it does not leak, uh, we're gonna stop building the, the PC. We'll start, we'll start with the PC. What we'll do is... Oh my lord. I'm looking at it, I'm like, damn, this looks really big for half inch. All right, so the time has come for me to put the water in the radiator. I don't know what to think, because um, I'm expecting the yes, worst. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start with regular water, uh, just to make sure that there's no leaks. Once everything is ready, I'm gonna go and I'll move in with distilled waters. <laughs> I had a funnel, but to be honest, I think I threw it off. I'm extremely nervous. What an idiot, look what I just found. A pump, what do you know? What do you know? I don't even remember buying this. Don't so stupid. Kid. That's awesome. I can't believe I just found that pump, man. That's just so freaking awesome. I don't even remember buying that thing, man. So what I'm doing here is I'm just stripping this out. <laughs> because I need to have the pump over here so I can feed it with water. So I'm going to just add this, like, this wire that I'm uh, splicing up so I can connect it to my power supply. So I can get the real force. Oh, all right. I think now it's fine. Then now I can possibly sit down and we can start this project. I know for a fact I got two leaders in here already. Two hours later. All right, well, it looks like it's working. Um, right now I'm getting all the air bubbles out, as you can see through the pipes. This thing, I already dropped four liters inside of this already. Uh, it looks like it's working, but the only problem <clears throat> I know is there's so much piping, I have to use two pumps. I'm getting all the air out right now. And yeah, two pumps, man. It didn't work with just one. It's a little loud right now because of it's still purging through. Dude, this thing is gonna be freaking crazy, son. Dude, my computer's gonna be so cool. Yeah, all the air bubbles, like I'm, I'm watching them all just like disappear. Dude, it just gobbled up with more water. So what I got here is uh, another liter. So this would be five liters. If this took all of it, it would be five liters. I don't think it's gonna take all, but I, I think it's gonna be four and a half liters. You know what's strange? I don't see any leaks. I just think it's kind of weird. It's not like me to not screw up something. This thing is dope, man. I'm not even kidding you. This, my computer is gonna be so cold. It's gonna be dope. It's gonna be cool. I just can't believe it, take, it needs two pumps. Dude, I still can't get over it, man. Two pumps. So let's see what we got. So you can see like all, you see all those bubbles? Those are all air bubbles, right? So every time I put a little bit of water in, the bubbles come up and it spits up a whole bunch of air and then it sucks more water in. As you can see, I did a lot of rework over here with these um, fittings and everything because I had to do some work. And then if you look up there, you can see that I did some holes for the pipes. So when I close the door, that's all air that's coming up. That's already my second towel. I had so much water on it the first time. It's so quiet. 
I mean, literally, like, it's all you can hear is the bubbles. Ready? Ready? Watch this. Wow, look at that, dude. Dude, every time those bubbles come up, it, go it, it go gobbles up more water. So basically, I'm starting to see the tubes clean it, clearing up, and I keep hearing like sloshes of air. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to let this run for a few days. See that right there? So that's actually where the hot water will be going through. The hot water will be coming through that, and then it'll be falling in here, passing through the fins. Fan will be on, then it'll be sucked up through here, and then spit back up. Cycle all over again. So that's what I got. So right now what I'm doing is I have one pump sucking and one pump blowing. I'm gonna keep both pumps. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave one pump inside attached to where the fan is and I'm gonna have the other pump with the reservoir inside of my media box. But I definitely would like to know how many liters passing through. So I've been looking at this digital uh, meter thing. Uh, I'll show you guys what I'm talking about. Check this out. So that's what I'm looking at right now. Um, I have some eBay points that I'm gonna use, but literally this thing here, I'm not sure if it's going to calculate gallons, but I know it calculates liters. So if you can see, it's got like that little thing on the side that tells you how many liters, right? And it tells you the temperature and it also has a flow regulator. That, that thing right there apparently has like an animation, that little swivel that looks like a tornado. So I'm gonna put that build that into a five and a quarter bay where I'm gonna have my, my this thing into my media box with my thermostat. I don't really care about the, th the temperature thing because I have my own stuff for that, is the liters. I wanna make sure that it stays consistent. That if I start noticing drops, then I know something's going on. It's coming from freaking China. So God knows when that will show up. So the bubbles are almost gone. It's too bad I'm gonna have to drain it. I gotta put distilled water in it. But this was just to check for leaks and I haven't seen any leaks. And I, I honestly, I don't understand how that's even possible for me because there's always something. And dude, this thing is like so quiet. Oh, I forgot to show you guys. Look what I did. You see, I added that metal on the sides. You see underneath to dress it up and there's one on that side. So now when you look at it like this, it just doesn't look stupid. Now it looks really nice and professional and clean. Oh shit, there was a giant bubble just went through. My shutoff valves are ready. I waited for my, my special, uh, my gray ones that, to come in. Shut off valve, then I'm gonna paint underneath that line because that looks horrible. But dude, seriously, I, I'm very happy with the way it came out. I'm gonna go ahead and stop putting together my PC um, this week because I know this is ready to go. So anyways, back to this. I got $27 in eBay points, so I'm only gonna have to put 13 bucks after taxes and everything. So I don't think that's a bad deal for this. So what I'll do is I'll get a five and a quarter thing and I'll cut it out with my with a nice precision cut and then I'll slide so this bitch in. You guys will get an update on this on Friday and uh, I'll, I'm gonna stop putting together my system this week, my other computer, so I can get this whole thing working. But I'm definitely gonna switch over to distilled water. You should never run regular water in here. I'm only doing that now just because like, to see how it works. All right, I, I hope you guys enjoy my video today. Um, you guys will see this tomorrow, today's Sunday. I just wanna say thank you to you guys for watching. Now, fuck that beach. Fuck that beach. Fuck that beach. Fuck that beach. All right, so I got this thing inspected by a high top quality inspector. The best inspector I could find. As you can see, she's a high top quality inspector. 18 years. Now she inspected my project and she's gonna stamp it. Wow. <laughs> she's good. I wouldn't want to lose her as an inspector, I tell you what. <laughs> well, at least I know it's in past inspection. Thank you very much.